Uh, this material here has been here for a good while as well. This part of the bike track could do with a bit of repair too. Just down uh, 50 metres, 20, 30 metres. Uh, the tiles on uh, this uh, are damaged. I suppose that's graffiti, I don't know. Uh, same damage, 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 damage. Oh. Mm hmm. Okay, uh, some more of the tiles damaged. I, I don't know who has responsibility for these gates, but this gate should be closed as well. This is not looking too good either. It's in the same park. Uh, down that way is the new leaf. And we can see some dump rubbish there on the corner. There's always dump rubbish around this area. I've had to get the council to take it away from time to time. There's another part of the bike track. Now this by no means is safe. Ride a, ride a bike along here and you'll have to perhaps have a mishap. This is another part of the bike track. Hardly safe I think. How long has this been here? And uh, here uh, a little bit more along the um, path, maybe 25 metres. Uh, we can run into this rubbish. Uh, walking the path a little bit further, we come to this sort of thing. And what are we to make of this? I don't know who is responsible for this. It might be Department of Housing, or whatever they call themselves now. Uh, it may be the council. I don't know, but. It's, it's in our local government area and it shouldn't be here. Uh, this is a play court uh, in the park. I don't know who owns the park. I don't know whether it's Fairfield Council or whether it's Department of Housing. But how can you expect sports people to play on a field like this? It looks like it's been like this for a good while. It's unsatisfactory. Whether it's the Department of uh, Housing or whether it's Fairfield Council that owns it, the point is that it's in our local government area, it is where we live, and it's not good enough. There's another bit of the pathway. Not exactly safe, I would suggest. <laughs> 